First group is true crabs, Brachycura. These are your classic crabs, the ones that showed up first in the fossil record around 200 million years ago in the Jurassic period. Somewhere back then, some long-bodied crustacean ancestor flattened out and tucked its tail under and boom, true crab. Every single modern true crab, and there are thousands of species of these, comes from that one original shift. So that's one time. Then you've got king crabs, and king crabs are fascinating because they're enormous, right? They're the ones you see in seafood restaurants that cost a ridiculous amount of money, but they're not actually true crabs. They're false crabs, and they evolved from hermit crabs. Yes, those little guys that carry shells around. At some point, a group of hermit crabs got too big for shells, stop using them and their bodies hardened up and flattened out into something that looks a whole lot like a regular crab. Except here's the weird part. If you look at a king crab's anatomy, it's still asymmetrical inside. Most of their organs are lopsided because hermit crabs have asymmetrical bodies so they can coil into the spiral snail shells. 